The demand for new weight loss medications just keeps skyrocketing across the country. While initially approved for people with diabetes, Wegovy has also been approved for people with cardiovascular disease who are obese or overweight. A local heart expert says these drugs are now a promising option for many patients. Both diet and obesity are risk factors for heart disease. And what we know is that poor diet is actually the top contributor to premature death in the United States, even more than tobacco. That is what makes these new weight loss drugs so potentially important, says Dr. Eric Brandt, the director of preventive cardiology at the University of Michigan. We haven't had good treatments to manage obesity um, that have large weight, lo weight loss outside of surgical approaches. So now that we have these medications that can drastically lower weight, but also lower the risk for cardiovascular disease, we're in a new era of medicine uh, with very good therapies to apply to those with unhealthy body weight. Wegovy is one of the new drugs that works by mimicking a hormone that occurs in the gut. It reduces feelings of hunger and may change how much a person desires food over time. In a clinical trial, it reduced the risk of a high-risk person having a heart attack or stroke by about 20%. Sustained weight loss, whether that's with medications or without medications, can drastically improve one's risk for heart disease. And that's because not only does decreased weight loss help to lower one's risk, but decreased weight loss often comes with improved blood pressure control, lower cholesterol, and also the lower risk for diabetes or a better management of diabetes if you're already diagnosed. Still, Brandt says there's much to learn about these medications. Over time, we're going to learn even more about uh, the nuances of exactly who should be treated with them, how long someone should stay on these medications, and whether they need to stay on them for the long term. A separate study estimates there are 6.6 million Americans who could now potentially benefit from Wegovy because they are obese and at high risk for heart problems but do not have diabetes.